Praise God. My name is Moses Koridiare, but it's the grace of God, I'm a servant of God in this ministry, Covered Ground Ministry International. I oversee the affairs of this ministry. And the department in the ministry is the film outreach, the film department. Uh, thank you so much. Thank you for loving this ministry. We appreciate your calls. We appreciate your gift. We appreciate your prayers. We appreciate everything that you have done for us. All we can say in Calvary is that the Lord God will reward you. Hallelujah. Now, we want to show you something that will definitely affect your life positively. I'm talking about one of our movies. I want us to watch it. It's a movie that you will watch and you will want to watch over and over and over again. The title of the movie is Cup of Christ, but I want to call it Bitterness of Ministry. Bitterness of Ministry. <laughs> ministry has a lot of bitterness. And that is why the Bible says we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principalities, against powers. There are principalities and powers that are fighting against ministry. That person that is doing you negative things in ministry. Hmm. The main reason why he's doing such against you is not because personally he just said you know. The reason is the devil. And we must attack the devil. Nobody that is in ministry that will make any success of ministry without eternal prayers. There are a lot of bitterness that ministers of God face. There are a lot of horrible bitterness. Some died in the course of ministry. Yes. Some were insulted in the course of ministry. Terrible embarrassment in the course of ministry. But you need to keep on. This is a theme that if you are close to tears, I'm telling you that you will shed tears. But the aim is not for you to shed tears for this man of God, but rather the aim is for you to look inward and then make things right in ministry. I pray for you that God will help you that as you are facing the bitterness of ministry, very, very soon, you will face the sweetness of ministry. The goodies of ministry will be your portion in the name of the Lord Jesus. I want you to do some things for us in this ministry. Number one, you subscribe to this ministry. You will see subscribe icon. Just tap on the icon and he will be there watching our film. I mean, then the subscribe, apart from you subscribing to the, to the YouTube channel, you also, we also want to, to share it with your friends. Share it. Let your friends enjoy what you are enjoying. Great things you are enjoying in this channel. Let others too enjoy what you are enjoying. And not only that, we want you to, to, not only to share it, we also want you to, to pray for us. We need your prayers. We need your prayers. We can't do anything without your prayers. And my prayer for you is that as you pray for us, the Lord will pray for you. <laughs> yes. Somebody is asking me that God can God pray for somebody? Yes. He said, uh, 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 the devil desires to have you, but I do what? I pray for you. So God will pray for you. Pray that God himself will pray for you. And your life will never, never remain the same again. Once more, you are welcome to Calvary Movies TV. The channel that will change your life from the position you are right now to a greater position. I mean, from now henceforth, you will cease to be a victim of circumstances. You will be a victor over circumstances in the name of the Lord Jesus. I'm saying from now henceforth, your name is changed. Your story has received a tremendous touch of God, and your story is not your glory. It will turn to your glory. See you out there. The Lord bless you. Welcome on board.
Baby, you Cover. don't need So why don't you <coughs> The power of resurrection Will save you Why, why don't you From your valley, to explain why God has not taken my life away, I prayed for death times uncountable, but death refused to come. Who will kill me? <laughs> ah. Who wants me? Caused be me. The morning of my life was glorious. <laughs> the afternoon of my life was pleasant. But the night of my life is full of pains, darkness, <laughs> calamities, <laughs> tragedies and failures. Oh, I am a failure in life. I am a failure in life. <laughs> I am a failure in life, Shade. Death, come! <laughs> oh, death! Come and take me, death! Mama, stop pushing yourself evil. There is still a whole fair tree that is cut down. The remaining shoot could still spring back to life. Eh? God could still do something out of your shattered life. Pick up the pieces of your life and, make, and now God made them whole for you. Hmm. Shady. My life is an example of a wasted glory. A wasted life. And wasted potentials. When it comes to issues that bothers on a spent life. How do you mean, Mama? <clears throat> Once upon a time. I was not just the wife of a general overseer of one of the largest Pentecostal churches in Lagos. I was a reverend under the flourishing ministry of my husband. The late Bishop Dr. Kingsley Greg Oputa We together ran the Power Pass Power Pentecostal Palace, the Five Ps. Five Ps was a church with 32 pastors on us. We had a beautiful daughter to be candid. God's financial blessings found good expression in our lives. But I lost all within a month. Shade, I lost my husband. <laughs> I lost my daughter. And that flourishing ministry. I lost all. 
Incredible. What on earth could have caused such a downward slide to disaster? To say the very least, thank God for the atoning of his apostolic anointing upon his people. On me? Ah, what is splendid to say the very least? Eh? Where is the splendor? <laughs> Another man. A pastor under you. Your son in the ministry cleverly played to the gallery and cannot won the happiness of the people. And you call that apostolic anointing? Eh? <laughs> Pastor, you can eat in my food. <laughs> Honey, why should you be so pissed up? On a matter that is divinely arranged by God. Yes, it is heavily arranged. Eh? I am a pastor by calling. And God grants him the ministry of healing and deliverance. And he is a miracle worker. God is using him to perform excellent miracles. Yeah, and that. Yes. that goes for a very beautiful compliment for the edification of the church of God, baby. Eh? No. Look, I won't fold my hands and watch that one subjugate you. Let me say this again for emphasis. Pastor Godfrey is only pulling a show that is targeted as forming his personal ministry. He must be stopped in his nefarious activities. Remember, a stitch in time does not only save nine, it could save thousands. I think the usual bro, Pastor Gaffrey is becoming a very serious one. Especially in these hours and in this in our ministry. Well, um, I think you better give me time to think about it. Let me sleep over it, my dear. Eh? <laughs> Let me sleep over it. Uh, Pastor Gaffrey. So weak that she couldn't even deliver the baby on her own. Apart from that, the positioning of the baby in the birth canal is very wrong. So we will need a cesarean section to bring out the baby. Cesarean what? Okay, okay, okay. What I mean is we will need to bring out the baby through an emergency surgical operation. My God. So registration, hospitalization, and uh, the surgery proper will cost about seventy thousand naira. Seventy thousand naira. Oh, oh, doctor, I'm just a preacher. I don't have one thought of that anywhere. But I know that my all-sufficient God will provide for me. All right. Or oh, your sufficient God will provide for you. Let's map out all your strategies and get the money fast. All right. 
waste no more time. Time is not on our side. You have delayed too long. Good luck. Thank you, doctor. Let's get back to us with. Sam, I feel I should talk to you to see if you could come to our head with that monster. Are you saying that Katrin is in the hospital right now, Lebanon? Yes, sir. Excuse me. Did you say the operation would cost you? 70,000 naira. 70,000 naira? Okay. How easy you check off 170,000 naira? <laughs> 70,000 naira for the operation proper. And um, 100,000 naira for your naming ceremony and other contingencies. Thank you, sir. Thank you so much, sir. My God, we'll continue to bless you richly. I appreciate you, sir. sir. No, 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 just stand up, Pastor, if you can say that. All right, come on. Um, let me get to the room and get you the check. That's a good thing. I know that Kitchen would, would give you bouncing baby boy. Hey, how about, about that? <laughs> go, free, go. Thank you, sir. Oh, honey. Yeah, uh, Pastor Godfrey. That the the wife. How are you, my pastor? <laughs> How is he with you, my pastor? Uh, I'm fine, ma'am. Only that my wife is having some difficulty in the bone that will mm -hmm. necessitate prompt surgical intervention. Oh, sorry. Yes, um. That Katrina is already in the hospital right now, they're in labor. And they feel that we should have seen them with something. In fact, I've told them that we'll give them a check of 170,000 naira. 70,000 naira for the surgical operation and the 100,000 naira for the naming ceremony and the other minor, minor expenses. How do you see that? Yeah, no problem, no problem. Okay. Hey, woman, please. Say, give yourself a story. Well, that's a girl, Pastor Goffrey. <laughs> Pastor Goffrey. Um, um, there is an issue that just arose a moment ago. In fact, I was about signing the check when I remembered that um, the building contractor was built to come for the money today. I mean, we're talking about the 200,000 naira. And you come back by next week for the money. I mean, before your naming ceremony proper. <sighs> sir. Please, sir. I thought you wanted to issue a check to me. Exactly. My wife is in pain. The doctor himself warned that I should act fast to avert the loss of her life. Oh, please, sir. Please, mommy, help, help me beg daddy. Please, sir. Pastor Godfrey, this issue should not be overflowed. Go and borrow the money elsewhere. You will not pay it back when the bishop gives out the 170,000 naira next week. Simple. Okay, sir. Can you please give me the 70,000 naira I need for the hospital? Pastor Godfrey, you don't seem to understand what I'm saying at all. I said the building contractor is coming for the money today. He's coming for his 200000 dollars today. Do you want us to disappoint him? By next week, we would have gotten enough money in the account. I will give it your, your, your check. Simple. Oh, 
Please, sir. I, I, I don't have what that means. Okay, sir. Can you please give me 40,000 naira and I will look around for the rest. Pastor Godfrey, why are you doing this? I promise to give you the money next week. You will get the money back next week, Pastor Godfrey. Hmm. And, and, and I'm sure our God is going to make supplies. Yes. Our God will provide where you do not even aspire. Yes. Trust him, Pastor Godfrey. Trust God. It's well, Pastor Godfrey. It's okay, Pastor Godfrey. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Mm -hmm. Words are inadequate to express my gratitude for this show of magnanimity. I appreciate you, sir. I pray that God Almighty will continue to bless you richly, sir. Thank you, sir. Amen and amen. Now, go quickly now to the hospital and uh, settle the bill. I hope to catch up with you later there in the day. Thank you, sir. That's all right. Thank you, Chief. What? Um, your wife? Yes. Um, no, in Jesus' name. Please, doctor, don't say it. Don't tell me my wife is there. I won't even say it, okay? Your wife is not dead. She's alive. In actual fact, she will no longer require any surgical operation. Praise God! Hallelujah. You see, she miraculously delivered the baby. But because of the depression and the exhaustion imposed on the fetus, it gave up the ghost about 10 minutes after the delivery. What gave up the ghost? We lost it. Lost what? Doctor, you lost what? The baby. My God! <sighs> Pastor Godfrey, don't you think there are some sins you needed to confess? Don't you think you have gotten your fingers soiled with sin and the severe consequences of the sins kept haunting you? Uh, 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 uh. That's okay, my dear. This COVID is okay. Eh? Pastor Godfrey, I'm sure you want to go into the corners of your room and make necessary, appropriate reflections of your life. And then you should make restitutions when it be. I think I'm correct, Pastor Godfrey. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Good day, Pastor Godfrey. Good day, Pastor Godfrey.
Pastor Godfrey. Chief, sir. sir. Ah. Good afternoon, sir. Where are you going? Uh, good afternoon, sir. Uh, uh, you uh, see, I plan to stop by at your place and uh, uh, just to have some uh, discussions with you. I hope. Uh, I was just wondering if we could discuss over some soft drinks on issues that I discovered to be very much important to you. It's okay by me. It's my pleasure, sir. Uh, uh, okay, okay. Pop in, Pastor. Pastor Godfrey, to say that uh, I was thoroughly embarrassed and surprised at seeing you trekking about town. Uh, that, well, that should be an understatement. In fact, I was very shocked. Yes. I, I don't know, and it amazes me, why Bishop Kingsley has not found it uh, interesting and uh, he has not found it worthwhile to buy you at least a Mercedes Benz S class. Ah, you, you, you are qualified for that. Ah, I don't know why he has not thought it fit. After all, the church has the money. Huh? And you see Bishop Bear Kisley and his wife, they parade themselves about town in choice cars and they live in the state of the art apartment. Why they now leave you out in the cold and then they subject you to excruciating poverty. In fact, uh, I think it is high time you liberated yourself from this physical, mental, and spiritual torture that they have subjected you to. Chief, sir, I, I wish I know what you actually desire for me. <laughs> so, you have not really uh, read between lines? Uh -uh. What I'm saying is that start your own ministry. Yes, yeah, start your own ministry. After all, you have the charisma, and then uh, you can rob soldier. I mean, you you have you can see some soldier to soldier with icons in the preaching ministry of today. Yes, uh, you see, start your own church, and I and I bet you, if ninety percent of the present members of a Bishop Kingsley's church will not find a very good abode under your church. Yeah, that, that's what will happen. After all, you, you have the anointing, your English is flawless, and uh, you perform miracles. While Bishop Kingsley only preaches without action, and no miracle. And you see, that's all that is needed to start a church. You go and prepare your budget, and I will pick the bill. I will pick up the bill. Yes, I will put the bill. I will Start you up in ministry. Yes. Uh, you, you, just, uh, you just keep on ruling miracles upon miracles. Keep on performing miracles. Uh, that is all we need. And keep on performing miracles. <laughs> sir, I, I appreciate you, sir. Oh, thank you so much for your and, uh, care. Uh, it's sir. a pleasure. Uh, but, sir, I would like to seek the face of God over your offer. Uh, and then... Um, as soon as God grants a go ahead, I will let you know. Chief Clement! Chief Clement! You want to set us up in ministry? Oh, thank you, God. Honey, nothing this good has ever crossed our way since we got married. Oh, Jesus! Praise the Lord! <laughs> Praise the Lord! Oh, God! Praise God! Chief Clifford of the land. Chief Clifford? Um, hello, sir. Yes, sir. <clears throat> 20 million era. Wow. Oh, yes, sir. Uh, uh, sir, like I told you, I, I will still want to pray. Uh, however, <laughs> there is green light. 
Oh, yes, sir. As soon as God says, go ahead, I will let you know. Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. What did he say? Chief Clifford wants me to come for 20 million naira. God! For, for landed properties and for takeoff runs. God! <laughs> Yeah, my head is swelling. <laughs> my head is spinning. Only hope I'm not dreaming. Twenty million naira for landed properties and take off us. <laughs> Thank God. It means that the building itself, furniture and musical instruments would be at least fifty million naira. <laughs> Oh, thank God, God, thank God. <laughs> um, I will see him by Monday. Monday? See him tomorrow. Honey, this is the opportunity we have been looking for. And opportunity is a function of time. If we play with time, opportunity could slip off our fingers. Eh? See him tomorrow. Honey, oh. In that case. Okay. I'll see him for Oh, that's nice. It's celebration time, yeah. eh? Oh, let's celebrate G G Jesus. Oh, thank God. You are happy. Your wife is glad. Opportunity has finally smiled on you. You want to get out of what you call persecution handed down to you by Bishop Kingsley and his wife. Hmm. Now you are set to start your home ministry. But listen, if you start your home ministry now, that ministry will not start. It will crumble like a pack of cards. Why, Baba? Why are you cursing me? Because you have not suffered enough. You are not thoroughly grounded. Do you want to prosper in life? Yes, yes, Baba. Do you want to excel in ministry? Yes, yes, Baba. Now, bring out a sheet of paper and a pen from your bag. Godfrey! 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 You will never make it in life. Yes. I won't forget what you did against me five years ago. I will continue to pay you back in your own coins. I will revenge. I will revenge. Godfrey, I will revenge. For you to excel in life and ministry, you need the following. Humility. Submission and obedience. Humility. Submission and obedience. But between humility and submission, there is a terrible agent. Humiliation. Mm. Humiliation is the terrible agent between humility and submission. Humiliation is the littlest test for humility. How will your humility be tested if you are not humiliated? The terrible agent between submission and obedience is suppression. Submission will suppress you. You are in a ministerial valley now. Can't it all joy 
when your leader, I mean the bishop of your church, uses you anyhow, anywhere, draw a valley. You must dwell in the valley of the of ministry before you climb up. All the wickedness you call your oppression is to press certain bad things out of your life. Dwell in the valley. Endure affliction. Sovereign, great trials, humiliation, lack, and rejections that are in the valley. We will bring you out of the valley in due time. Those who want instant success in ministry, who do not want to suffer under a leadership, how wicked their so-called ministry is. There is need for dwelling for long period in the valley. Before I shoot it now to mountain top of glory. There are ladders in the valley that you must gradually but progressively climb. Don't be like many so-called ministers that once God grants them a gift in the valley or they have a glimpse of revelation in the valley hmm. they want to jump out to start what they call ministry hmm. they want to jump out of the valley to start what they call ministry those people never get to the mountain top of glory Don't start any ministry now. Ah, Baba? Baba? Ah. So it's a dream. Pastor Godfrey, I gathered from a very reliable source that you are trying to pull down the church with the sole name of starting your own ministry. Mm -hmm. eh? The church will graciously labor to build over the years. No, ma. Nothing could be so far from the truth. Then I'm lying. I didn't say that, ma. You will achieve in the desire to pray for a sick child. Yes, sir. It was strictly on the invitation of the chief. And you thought it improper to secure and, and receive an approval from her hand before going to the chief's house to pray for the daughter. No, sir. But, sir, I, 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 I just felt... Sir. See yourself. Only hypocrites and deceivers stammer when answering simple questions. Pastor Goffrey, you will have a Nigerian Christian Corpus Fellowship for their state congress. Yes, sir. But it was after due approval from your hand. But I gave you oral approval. You were too impatient to receive written approval. Uh, sir, you didn't ask me to write any letter. Most of previous invitations have been approved without any written letter. My judgment is this. You will no longer have the pulpits on Sundays or any other meeting days. In fact, I strip you of the title of a pastor. You are no longer one of the pastors of the Power, Pas Power Pentecostal Palace. Secondly, going to people's house to pray for them, conduct deliverances, counsel them, is hereby prohibited. Thirdly, honoring any invitation to minister in any church or any country is hereby 
prohibited. Am I properly understood? Yes, sir. You may go. Thank you, sir. Uh, don't go yet. It is now a taboo for you to receive any of the rich men on visits to your house. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Listen, you'll be moving to the Hoshi department to be one of the ushers of the church. You'll be operating under Pastor Henry. Did you get that? Thank you, sir. Focus, sir. Dance, 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 dance. Oh, stand. It's about for a short time, please stand. Stand, oh, stand, stand. What a shame. What a ridicule. God, you deserve much more than that. Eh? I told you, let's leave the church. But you refused. Eh? You refused. What is the use of a church where you will be treated not even like a second class citizen, but like a dog? <laughs> God. Oh, what a demotion! Eh? You that people call pastor, they will not call you Brock Godfrey. Eh? What have we got to show for several years of service to the church? Nothing. Nothing. You are no longer a pastor. You are no longer an ordinary usher. Ordinary usher. Hello, sir. The die is cast. Yeah, the pendulum of opportunity has finally swung to your favor. Now that uh, you are not a pastor in uh, Bishop Kingsley's uh, church, it is time now for you to show him that you have all it takes to be a general overseer and a bishop. Uh, and I have decided to increase your takeoff grant to 25 million naira. What did you just say now, sir? I, I think you heard me uh, clear. You heard, you heard me very clearly. Yes, 25 million naira. And uh, you come for the check of that money first in tomorrow morning. Thank you, sir. Thank you so much. It's a pleasure. Uh, but, uh, see, but, but, uh, uh, but what? Let me pray about it. Thank you, sir. Did I hear you say you want to pray? Something is seriously wrong with us somewhere. Eh? Huh? This is an attack from home. This is a high caliber attack. You either need serious prayers of deliverance. Huh? We need to visit a psychiatric doctor. There. Mm. Yeah. You see, I'm okay. Mm. Hey, yeah, you, nothing is wrong with me. Mm. Um, nothing is wrong with me. You see, um, in the valley of Macon. Mm. Oh yes. <laughs> and God will take us to the mountain of glory very soon. Yeah. <laughs> let's wait, let's wait. Mm. It will soon come. Let's wait for the time of God. Praise the Lord!
so me? I didn't do it. God did it. Pastor Godfrey. Bishop. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Pastor Godfrey. Bishop, ah, is gone. I will have been dead by now. Thank you, Pastor Godfrey. Ah. Bishop, oh, Bishop is gone. God could have used anybody. God did it. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Madman. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Ah, in Jesus' name. 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 Thank you, Godfrey. Thank you for delivering our bishop. Ah, thank, thank you, you very delivery. much. Ah, if not because of you, thank you. Holy ah. Spirit, ah. oh, thank you. Oh, thank you, God, the life of Godfrey. Ah. God's spirit. Ah. Well, you open the way. Ah. You open the way. Ah. Yeah. Bishop, I need to open the way. Open the way. La 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 ha <laughs> that was a great one. Look, you are now the toast of the whole church. Look, this is my friend, Barrister Lawansi. Yes, he has decided to join me to finance your church. The two of us will give you 30 million naira. 30. I think that should be okay to start with. And uh, you see, all we ask from you is just to make us the board of trustees of the new church. That's all. That's all. I mean, in fact, if you step out of this church today to start your own ministry, ah, with what, what has just happened in this church, no single person will be left in this church. In fact, I will advise you to do something. Do something. The whole world is shouting your praise. I mean, ah. Well, I appreciate you so much, sir. But God didn't tell me to leave this church. I'm contented here. Uh, more so, I'm called to build and not to scatter. Chief Clifford, sir, I will henceforth be grateful if you desist from discussing this issue with me again. Thank you. Excuse me. This is the time to really deal with this book. Godfrey, your joy must not last. Your joy must be shortened. Instead of grace, the whole church stay your stand, oh stand. It's bad for a short time, please stand. Stand, oh stand, stand, oh stand. Oh, Brother Godfrey, nice to see you. How is it with you? I'm fine, ma'am. Um, I came to see Papa. The head just sent me to him. Oh, he left for Abuja about an hour ago. In fact, his flight should be about landing at Abuja right now. I hope I, I could be of any help. It's yesterday's tight and offering collections. Uh, it's 122,375 naira. Now, I wouldn't know if I could drop it with you. Okay. Eh, okay. uh, let me seize this opportunity to appreciate what you did last Sunday. You see, the devil really wanted to mess up the bishop. 
Thank God for little mercies and for your timely intervention. We will have been mourning by now. Um, ma, only God should be praised. He could have used, he could have equally used just anybody. <laughs> Betty used you. No. <laughs> I really appreciate you, bro Godfrey. God used you for that last Monday. We are very grateful, sir. Oh. God bless you. It's okay. <laughs> Let's praise God. He could have equally used just anybody. <laughs> <laughs> I, I should be on my way home. Okay, okay. Uh, one more thing. When Papa comes, I will advise him to restore you back to your position as a pastor. And what about that? That's okay. I'm going to be glad. I will, I will praise God for that if this is it. Okay. I appreciate you. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Ma. <laughs> Thank you. Have a nice time. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> He is very soft spoken, very gentle, extremely humble, very, very handsome. If not for what he did against me five years ago, I will have. <sighs> ah! You are a thief! You are a liar! You are a thief! Oh, what an insult! Me? You could have the audacity and the pomposity to say it to my face! To my face, Godfrey, that you gave me money! You! You are a bastard! Leaders of God's church, in this headquarter church, and stakeholders of this church, it amazes me, it beats my imagination that a pastor in this church, oh, could throw all curses to the wind. That a pastor in this church is a thief. What a shame. I never knew, I never knew. He was a thief. Bishop, so you never knew that uh, you have been dealing with thieves all this while? Uh. Let me tell you, any courageous individual must essentially be a thief. This one is not only courageous, but jealous of what God is doing in this church. He has visited my house without count for assistance to help him start his own ministry. Yes. Is it because, is it because I've not been lousy and uh, talkative to be carrying this thing all around. Uh, he, look, this man, <laughs> he called Bishop names. He said he's a wicked man and that he wanted his freedom. Ah! Ah! Chief! Chief! What is the Church of God turning to? Yeah, I wonder. It's a for thieves and criminals. I feel like cutting you to pieces. If not for Christ. Idiot. Mommy. Mommy. Why are you so hostile? In what way have I wronged you? You know I gave the money to you. I gave you the money. I, I gave you, I gave you money. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Son of a bitch. <laughs> you are a disgrace to God and humanity. Even to the church of God. You will regret, oh. you will regret this action of yours. I won't want us to waste time on this issue at all. Godfrey, <laughs> this is my judgment. I will want you to produce my money, no, no, I mean God's money, within the next three days, or I hand you over to the police. 
Never, never you think you could run away. Because here we get to nabbed. Hey, Will you stand, 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 you stand? Oh, stand. stand. It's bad for a short time. <sighs> stand, 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 stand. God. This suffering is too much. This agony is provoking. This character assassination is unbearable. God, where are you? Jesus, where are you? Why do you seem so far? Ah! God. Why is the righteous subjected to the ridicule of the unrighteous? God. Why? I have just one day left. One day left to produce the 122,000 Naira I knew nothing about. God! God! Have mercy on me! God! Where are you? God! Arise! Arise and fight for me. Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. Hello, Mama. How are you, my pastor? Yes, ma. You need to come to our house in no time. The bishop will want to talk with you. Yes, ma. All right. Okay. <coughs> oh, good day, Pastor Godfrey. Um, Godfrey, or oh, at best. Bro, Godfrey, you wanted to say. To anybody else, you could go for Bro Godfrey. But to me, your Pastor Godfrey, I worry at the humiliation you've been subjected to. I know you are innocent. The charges against you are man made and cooked up. But be rest assured, your God will see you through this traumatic period. I, I wonder why mommy should just cook up such a scandalous slice against you. <laughs> but something good will work out soon in your favor. Thank you. Amen. Um, Mama called me that Papa would want to see me. Uh, yes. I got to wind of that some few minutes back, but they are hard to say they are the bios. Just settle yourself down, they should be back in a moment. Alright. Thank you. Thanks. You're the best man I've ever set my hands on. I love you. Agreeing to give me a place in your heart will be the best thing that has ever happened to you. <laughs> Mommy and Daddy will just bury the hatchet and let sleeping dog lie. <laughs> if you can give me a place in your heart, you will become the number two strongest man. In power, past power, Pentecost, top hours. Uh, second only to my dad. 
<laughs> if you can give me your love. You know that's impossible. I'm properly married. I'm not cut out for such a spurious extramarital relationship. Uh, also, I fear God. I fear God. I'm not asking you to do that either. But <laughs> you can find him a case for divorce. Just count all the cases that we accrue to you. As the husband of the daughter of Bishop Kingsley Samson Puta, the general overseer and the presiding bishop of Power Post Power Pentecostal Palace, I, I think that should blow your head. <laughs> Clara, let's forget this issue. Let's suspend it. Huh? Right? I will suspend it. But that will surely occupy a discussion next time. No, no, okay? no, 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 no. Forget it for him. Okay. Do you care for a class of orange squash as you are with them? Uh, uh, thanks for your concern. But I'm okay. Well, just give me a few minutes. I'll be back to you. Many of you are very much aware of how Godfrey, a brother in this church, a preacher, a former pastor of this church, a self proclaimed, a self acclaimed miracle worker, stole 122,000 naira of the church money. And we were all kind enough to give him three days of the mention to return the money. Up till now, Godfrey has not found it worthy to return the church money. Is that the shocker? Is that the surprise? That is not the shocker. The surprising thing is this. Godfrey 
has the audacity, the temerity, the pomposity. He has the impudence of going to my house. Godfrey went to my house and rough handled my only daughter who happened to be a virgin. Godfrey gripped her, tore her clothes and all this. Remove her plan. And Godfrey raped my daughter. Ah, I did. I didn't do that. What a wicked soul. What a rabbit wolf. What a man. Godfrey. What a drug in the image of a man. I didn't do it. I didn't do it. Shut up, your daddy. Shut up. My God. My God. Pastor Henry. You know, you are the best friend I ever had. You know I would not do that. I didn't do it. Coffee. Coffee. You are weak. How dare you? Let this. Don't get like this. How dare you? Coffee. Destroy the fragility of a young girl like this. To satisfy your satanic lust. Ah! Be God's weapon. A vengeance! The same devil on you! No! <laughs> no! Mary, please! Mommy, please! I know my husband! I know him! He wouldn't do such a thing! Edas, please! Please! Mommy, please! Come. Brothers and sisters, we must please not take the laws into our hands. We are Christians. I have therefore decided to invite the law enforcement agents to do justice to this case. Officers, would you be kind enough to please come and arrest him? Jesus! My God! Please! Mommy, please! 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 Oh my God! Ah, Jesus! Please! Oh, Daddy, please! Please! Ah, Mommy, please! Oh my God! My God, please! Oh my God! Please! Officers, please! Please! Oh, no Oh my God! Please, please, officers, please. please. My dear, please. don't cry for me. Oh my God! Just pray for me. My God! Pray for me. This present suffering is nothing to be compared with the glory that is yet to be revealed. I love you. Oh dear. Dear, I love you. I love you. Oh. I know. I'm not going to die in the prison. We will not die. We'll see you again. Yes. We'll come together again as husband and wife. Oh, Jesus. <gasps> Even if I die in the prison. You will not die! <laughs> I want you to be strong in faith. Let the whole world see Christ in you. Let others see Christ in you. <laughs> Let others see Christ in you. <laughs> Keep telling the stories. <coughs> Be strong in faith and in truth. <coughs> Let others see Christ in you. Oh, <laughs> let all the children Jesus in you. Let, let all the see Jesus in you. <laughs> Keep telling the story, be faithful and true. Let all that see Jesus. Jesus is in the world, you have tribulations, but cheer up, cause I've overcome the world. Oh yeah, it's meant to be like that. Old man, 
You can visit him again in the cell. <laughs> ah. God free my son. I can visit my beloved anywhere, any day, and any time. I even love visiting them in time of trouble like this. You are troubled. You are sad that we allow you to pass through what you are passing through now. In Matthew chapter 20, verse 22, Jesus asked the mother of Sebedee's son this question. Are you able to drink of the cup that I am about to drink? And be baptized with baptism that I am baptized with? That is the cup of Christ. The cup of Christ is the cup of sorrow. The cup of shame. The cup of humiliation. Every genuine and original Christian must have part in this cup. You can't throw from this cup. Have you heard that? It was said that those who want live a godly life in this world must suffer persecution. It is a must. You must pass through the experience and query experience of the Christian journey. You must pass through the query experience of Christian journey. Baba, what is query experience? A query is where a stone is broken into pieces. Where a stone is broken down to pieces. Where stones are grounded, broken, and shaped into desired taste. If a stone or rock is not caught, grounded, and broken, it cannot be used for any beauty. That he did. She has not told me exactly what he did that provoked such a wicked treatment for you. Godfrey. Pastor Godfrey. My destiny was tied to him. My life was tied to him. In fact, Godfrey holds the key to my making it in life. But he denied me that opportunity. Godfrey did bad to me. How? How? Why? Pick a number in your mind. Don't bother to tell me the number you've picked. That will be made known to you by me. Fire on the mountain. Things are about falling apart. The bond of your home is heading for the rocks to get shattered into pieces. And no man will be able to collect the fragments together. How do you mean? Only one. You pick number nine. Uh, yes. Your husband. The bishop has only five more years to live. At the nape of the fifth year, maggot and worms will feast on his flesh. Ah! I'm finished. If that happens, his family will throw me out. Please. Do something. Do everything possible to see that the bishop doesn't die. Please, don't let him die. 
<laughs> Can man that judge have spoken? His words are infallible. The bishop would die. Ah, I don't have a male child by him. You know he's already the only one. If that happens, his family will throw me out. Okay. Uh, even if the bishop would die, let me have a male child by him first. Please. Please. You can't have a male child by him. Your star is not in synchrony with this. You can only have a measure in this world by only one man. One man? And who is that man? Godfrey Hepo. One of the pastors in your church. Lure him to have sex with you. And a measure will be the result of the union. You can then tie the child down to the bishop. The bishop won't know. Pastor Godfrey. Incredible. What? I badly needed a male child. If I don't want to be pushed out of bishop's house in the event of his demise. So I lured Godfrey to an hotel tried to seduce him, but he refused. I knelt down for him and promised him a reward of two million naira to sleep with me, but he stuck to his gun. I even explained the implications to him, but Godfrey refused me. I thought that was a bad act by a man to me. I therefore decided to pay him back in his own coins. The rape allegation was planned and executed by my daughter and I. My husband never knew anything. I never knew I could be sentenced to such a long prison term. <laughs> Eleven years for embezzlement. Fourteen years for, for rape and abuse. <sighs> Making a total of 25 years. Oh my God. Oh my God. Of what use will I be to you, to myself and to God, by the time 25 years is added to my present age? I don't know. The reason for my pains and worries boils down to you, down to myself. There. Will you be able to wait for 25 years? Will you be able to wait for me for 25 years, considering your present age? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry for allowing to be part of this. I will come. God will take care of me. My marriage vow to you was for better, for worse. And the word of God compelled me to wait for you. Oh, I love you, dear. I love you. I love you. Oh, I'm sure we won't overcome. Bye. <laughs> When the morning comes <laughs> When
the saints are gathered to know we will tell the story how we overcome we will understand it better by our Time up. <gasps> this one will be mine. <laughs> Time up. It will be yours. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Adam, it's okay. Well, no, please, 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 please. The time is over. Please. Oh, my, my God. Please, oh, okay. It's okay. Please. Jesus will be with you. Oh, now. Oh, 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 Leave him, leave him. The time is up. There are who definitely see him. Oh, God! My friend, oh, God! God! What a lie! What a wickedness! You shouldn't have done that, ma! May your life never be consumed by the loss for fame, power, and position. If the spirit of the world really grasp an individual, the satisfaction offered by those actions will be covered by his actions. If people in the position of authority will be conscious of the consequences of their actions, then the world will be a better place to live. I was not conscious of my actions until my actions consumed me. Ma, I want to know how you felt. Then I want to know how the glamorous woman I saw in your story became what I'm seeing now. What happened to Pastor Godfrey after he was imprisoned? Godfrey was imprisoned. But what happened after the imprisonment was terrible. Yes, Chief look, look, I understand it perfectly well. But you see, I am in a very difficult situation. Look, by virtue of my position as the controller of prisons, I have to be very careful to Look, I, I'm in a delicate position. Look, so many of my subordinates are not happy with my position. They would rather be in my position. So I have to be very careful. If they get to know, and the information gets to the government, I am finished. I mean, I'll be sacked from my position. I will lose my job. My home will collapse. I may even end up losing my life. Because I'll be charged for murder. Look, Chief, let us leave it at two inmates. Two inmates are enough for the rituals. Mr. Controller of Prisons. Why are you behaving like a novice in this matter? It's as if you don't even have experience of the business. Um, I'll make it 500,000 Naira per head. Which means you're going to collect 2 million Naira for 4 people. No, Chief. I won't do it. Let us leave it at 2 inmates. Moreover, these people we are talking about, they are human beings like us. Let us leave it at two. In fact, four will generate unnecessary controversy and publicity. Let us leave it at two inmates. I give you 2.5 million naira for three people.
that means about 800,000 per head. Yes, exactly. And that is it. This thing is simple. Or what you need to say is that they died of chronic illness. And you just get a medical doctor to give you death certificates. And you give him part of the money that I'm going to give to you. That settles it. Hmm. Chief, <laughs> it's a deal. has granted a request to decongest this prison. For this reason, um, the three of you will be moved to the Makodi prison with immediate effect. Libinos is my favorite guy and I don't want him to suffer in prison. All our efforts to bribe the presiding judge to swing the murder case to our favor field. I want you to be his guardian. And I know that won't go. For fun. I have a little looking for you. Take. That's a hundred thousand for you to do your job well on him. If he comes out, he'll and hearty. You'll be answering every word. Promise me. <laughs> I will do my best. Thank you so much. It's a pleasure. Thank you. <laughs> Leaving us. Is this not leaving us? Yes, sir. Leaving us. Um, look, take leaving us back and bring another inmate on your list. We are gone. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Uh, yes, look, bring inmates C5. Yes, uh, Godfrey Echo. Yes, bring Godfrey Echo. Uh, Godfrey, yes. Um, I was just telling your colleagues that um, to decongest this prison, uh, we'll be moving some of you to the Makodi prison. So you get prepared and move with immediate effect. Um, The Venus is very lucky. He has just escaped death by the whiskers. We are going to die. They are going to kill us. That is their new method of the congesting prison nowadays. They are going to kill us. Oh. No, 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 no. We are not going to die in Jesus' name. They are not going to kill us in the mighty name of Jesus. Mm -hmm. yeah. oh. <laughs> 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 Thank you, G. 
Jesus. I have escaped from the tormentors of my life. <laughs> you to the main road, eh? Well, I'm sure we would get at least somebody to help us. Please get up there. Ah, 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 dear. Let me tie this wound so that it, it will stop bleeding. won this battle. I'm going to meet with my father in heaven. I'm leaving, I'm leaving you behind. But I know that Jesus will never depart from you. He will comfort you. Just fight the good fight of faith. Take care of yourself. Take care of yourself. Take care of yourself. <laughs> no. You will not die. In the name of Jesus. God. The enemy must not rejoice over our lives. God. This man served you. With all the strength and the grace you gave him, Jesus. He said unto us, help us, help us, Lord. Dear, you will not die in the name of Jesus. Yeah. Yeah. I'm weary. I'm feeling uncomfortable. Yeah, I'm not comfortable. I'm going to meet with my father in heaven. This tabernacle can no longer contain my spirit. Yeah, I love you. I love you. But I'm leaving you behind. I'm leaving you behind. I'm going home before you. Let, let me see you at home. Yeah, let me see you at home. Hold on to the faith. Fight the good fight of faith. Let all that's in Jesus in you. Let all that's Jesus in you keep telling the story. 
been faithful and true. Let all that see Jesus in you. <laughs> God, this man is no longer talking to me. Is he dead? God, is he dead? Jesus, I'm asking you, is my husband dead? Despite all he did in your service. God, do you mean you can allow this lovely, innocent Christian to die from the torture of the ungodly? God, the death of this man will definitely not give glory to your name. Jesus, you didn't tell me that. <laughs> God, do you mean I'm not a widow? Have mercy on me. Do change your mood, change your have mercy on me. Jesus, God, have mercy on me. The great life of the tribe of Judah. Where are you? Where are you? God of Elisha, where are you? <laughs> where are you, God? Jesus! Jesus, help me! <laughs>
man. Dead man, dead man. You are a dead man. Dead king. See you how. How? Why? You will be dead today. Ah. No. <laughs> Save your wine. Hey? I've done all the things you told me to do. Ah. I've dotted all my I's and crossed all my T's. The three men that I made for the rituals have been led to the slaughter slab. <sighs> Save you. Save you. Dead, Babu. Dead. Your net have caught a wrong fish. Go for it, It's a plug in the wheel of the progress of your life. The God says, God for must not be used for the ritual. If God for either by omission or permission is slaughtered, then you must die. Your life as a link with his life. Your survivor hinges on his survivor. The very minute he is slaughtered will be the very minute you will die. This is a total tragedy. Here, yeah. untold calamity, dead. Save you. Don't let me die. I must not die. Ah, to die at this time. Ah, I must not die. Then Governor Hippo must not die too. Thank you. I will call them now. I will call the boys to stop the killing. Not reachable. Eh? They must have entered into the bush where there is no service. Ah, I'm in trouble now. I'm in trouble. What can I do? Eh? Savior. Eh? What can I do? Then you are finished. Finished? Finished? I can't be finished. Okay. Yes. I told the boys to slaughter them at 6 p.m. And this is just cut out to five. I think I can make the journey in one hour. I'll get there and stop them. I'm on my way. Save you. I will make sure I stop them. I can't die now. Ah. God! You are a great deliverer. You delivered Daniel from the den of lions. You delivered the three Hebrew children from the fiery flame of fire. God, deliver me. Don't let us be used for sacrifice. Amen. God. God. Deliver us, God. Amen. Ah, God, deliver us. Amen. Oh, I must get there. I must get there before it's 6 p.m. Oh, oh, God. God, free echo must not die. He must not die. Oh, my God. Oh, God. Stop. 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 Come, 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 come. Come. Come, come. Take, take this one thousand. No, 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 no. Okay, take, 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 take thousand now. Stop. Please. Stop. 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 Stop.
I'm rushing to somewhere. Open your boots, open your boots, open your boots. Okay. I'm rushing to somewhere. Okay. Open your boots. Okay, okay. I'm rushing, I'm rushing to somewhere, I'm rushing. Go. Too late. The men will have been slaughtered before he gets there. Judging from what I'm seeing from here. Sorry sir, you cannot go. Sorry. What? Sorry, sorry, sorry. You have to waste my time. Sorry, sorry, you are sorry, a stupid. Sorry, sorry, you are a sorry, sorry. fool. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Nonsense. Rubbish. 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 You are stupid. You are stupid. You are stupid. Here. Only 40 minutes to go. 40 minutes. These foolish people, they have really wasted my time. They have really wasted my time. Now, bring the basin to collect their blood because we have just 30 minutes more to cut off their heads and remove their blood. Oh my god. 15 minutes more. 15 minutes. Oh god. to go. Any last message from any of you? Ah. Uh, my last message is that, is that Jesus loves every sinner. Uh, and God loves you. Uh, oh God. Be with my wife. Protect her. Take care of ah. 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 Shut up! Hey, two minutes more. I'm almost there. I'm almost there. Yeah. One minute to six. Get ready to cut their throat. Hamper the kind of terror.
power. Super power. Super power. Super power. Super power. And nothing costs to pay you. All oh, if you don't cooperate. It is a fearful thing to fall into the hands of the living God. God came to the rescue of Godfrey at the last second by using hunters to save his life. All the ritualists were arrested. Chief Dennis. Mr. Hughes, the prison controller. The warders involved. And Tutulangpa, the spiritualist. They were all sentenced to death by hanging. That bad occurrence also marked the beginning of my doom. Jade. Yes, ma. I missed it. I missed it, Shade. I was not contented with what I had. I wanted a male child by the devil. I forsook God. The devil didn't give me a male child. He only collected the only daughter I had. Clara. <laughs> My only hope, Clara, my only daughter, she died the very day she graduated from the university as a medical doctor. Clara, the girl you frame up against Pastor Godfrey, <laughs> you mean she died the day she became a medical doctor? Mm -hmm. What a tragedy. What a loss. That was not all. Another tragedy struck me the same day. Very, very painful. We lost our only daughter, our only hope, our only tomorrow. She was murdered in cold blood. She was killed in cold blood. But that now we're standing there. We should not allow our lives to go crashing because of that. Let's pick up the pieces of our lives together again. The Lord will be with us. The Lord will be with us. We encourage us. Take it easy. What a loss. What a sadness. Hello, gentlemen. What can I do for you? Yes, I am uh, Reverend Dr. Ibitayo. Yes, I'm in charge of the uh, end time revenge mission. Okay. And he is a uh, Pastor John Okay. How are you? The pleasure of meeting you. Yes, we are. Good day. Good day. Yeah. What can we do for you? Yes. Smart car. 
I want you to go straight to go and bring the 2.3 million naira you collected from bank today and hand it over gently to me. You must be crazy! Excuse me, sir. I equally want to beg you in the name of God that you had all your wife's jewelries. And uh, I will prefer we go in together. You no. may need my help, sir. Oh, please, I beg you in the name of the Lord. We have just lost our only daughter. We have just been bereaved. Don't confront our problems. Please, please, uh, please. You better yes, move. Yes, sir. Move, move Mr. Move. 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 disastrous end. I lost everything on the same day. My blood pressure shot up. The hypertension resulted in stroke and paralysis. And that was how I became paralyzed. All the pastors in the church started their own churches. Godfrey was freed. All my friends and associates deserted me. All the pastors in the church started their own churches. I was left in the cold, a paralyzed woman. Godfrey started his own ministry three months later. He is now the founder and pastor of the popular holiness unto the Lord Chapel. You mean Pastor Godfrey is the founder of holiness unto the Lord Chapel? That very large church at Bariga in Lagos? Yes. The neglected, the oppressed, the harassed Godfrey of yesterday is now the pastor and founder of the largest church in Africa. See, Mommy Margaret to be one of the greatest things that has ever happened to me. I searched out everywhere for her. I've made so many announcements, but nobody could tell her where about. I'm glad that you said, that you said, you saw her. <laughs> I will lead you to the very place where I saw her. I heard she's paralyzed. My God will hear her. Amen. She'll be flown to America first thing next week. Oh. You, you will take her to the bungalow I arranged for her. Okay, okay. I will make sure that she lives the, the rest of her life in her best possible comfort. Yes. Despite all she did to you, all she did against me, I count them all joy. Mm. She gave me the cup of Christ to drink. Yes. And I'm glad I took it with joy. <laughs> it is the cup of Christ that has made me what I am today. And Mr. Jacobs. <laughs> you didn't drink it all alone. Oh. You know? I drank a good portion of the content of that cup too. Sure you did, <laughs> you did. <laughs> mm. The morning of my life was good. The afternoon of my life was great. 
but the night of my life <laughs> is full of bitterness. Let the rich men of today know that there will be a tomorrow. Let them know that tomorrow is not always very sweet. <coughs> Tell the geos of today, the general overseers of today, the senior pastors of today, that they should treat the younger ministers under them with love and respect. They should know that if you truncate a rising star under you for petty jealousy, you might truncate your life and ministry. I learned this lesson when it was too late. Oh. <laughs> Woe unto me for allowing my husband and daughter to share in my sin. Woe unto me for allowing greed to take the better part of my life. Woe unto me for refusing to accept Jesus genuinely into my life. <laughs> Woe unto me for loving this world and the things in the world. Woe unto me for causing pains and hardships for God free. Oh. oh my God, my God. Jesus, mommy, mommy. Ah, mama. Ah. Mommy, Margaret. Mommy. Mommy, Margaret. Mommy. Oh. <coughs> I'm very glad to see you. Thank see, God. I have come to yes. take you to where you belong. Yes. Mommy, oh. Margaret. Godfrey. Oh, Jesus. Godfrey. <laughs> Godfrey. Mommy. So you could come in search for me. I, I counted it all, Joy. Yes, mommy. Ah. Mommy, let's go, let's go. Woe unto me! Mommy, don't say that. Let's go. Woe unto me! Let me stop it, eh? Ah. Let's go. Woe! No, mommy! Stand, 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 stand Oh, stand It's bad for a short time, please stand Stand, oh, stand, stand Oh, stand It's bad for a short time, please stand Jesus says in the world you have tribulations But cheer up cause I've overcome the world Oh yeah, it's meant to be like that Oh please stand, for a short time please stand Oh stand, 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 stand Oh stand it's bad for a short time, please stand. Oh, 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 oh stand, stand. Oh, 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 stand. It's bad for a short time, please stand. Where you stand? Oh, stand, 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 oh, stand, oh, stand. Yeah. It's bad for a short time, please stand. My brother, please stand, stand. My sister, please stand, oh, stand. Oh, it's 
last but for a short time please stand oh stand oh stand it's but for a short time please will you stand 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 oh stand it's but for a short time please stand Stand, oh stand, stand, oh stand It's but for a short time, please stand Jesus says in the word you have tribulations But cheer up cause I've overcome the world Oh yeah, it's bad to be like that Please stand for a short time, please stand. Oh, stand, 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 stand. Oh, stand. It's but for a short time, please stand.